So Lent is definitely my most favorite time of year in the Christian liturgical calendar. Because it points us and reconnects us to uh, our roots, our spiritual roots in the Christian wisdom tradition. There's a particular piece there. And traditionally, when the early Christians developed this practice of Lent, it was to make solemnness and repentance a part of, you know, the life and the spirituality of the church, always opening up and leading up to ultimately the new life of, of Easter. And while these traditional ideas are really moving and important for a lot of people, uh, it doesn't work for everyone and there's always room for new understanding and, and some fresh ideas. The word Lent itself uh, actually comes from a, an old Anglo-Saxon term called lengthen, meaning to lengthen, which refers to the lengthening of days during spring when uh, the days are getting longer, right? And spring's always thought of as a time of rebirth and renewal and rejuvenation. So when I get to the heart of what Lent and Lenten practices are, are all about, it really, for me, comes back down to self-renewal, self-reflection. So participating in Lent is a way that we can reconnect not only with this wisdom heritage, but also gives us opportunities to recenter in God's love and open us up to new types of awareness.